What I was reporting on was one of the studies that we got funded for from the United States Golf Association. It was to look at the effects of brushing on uh, creeping bent grass health. Our study specifically looked at brushing treatments, but not so much what, what's the best brush or anything like that, but more what brushing did to the plant. Did it improve texture? Did it improve density along those lines and fineness of the plant? And also, too, did it induce any type of stress, both visually and physiologically? So we were looking at internal plant measurements, if there's any stress going on from our continual brushing treatments. And if there was, we wanted to know too is how long would it take the plant to recover from that and thus we could look at timing of brushing. This year and we used soft brushes, we used Jacobson Eclipse mowers with the floating head and so we had the brushing units on the mowers and we were rotating the brushes in the forward motion. Although I know a lot of people do reverse, we were trying to uh, duplicate an out front brush, either brushing once a week or three times a week. But we found that given this year, we saw no stress for the plant. We saw the improvements in the, in the quality we saw. So if you move your hand across the turf and brush it up, you notice there can be uh, wide leaf blades, maybe a little storm, but mainly those wide leaf blades that you try to get out to improve the, the texture and the fineness. And compared to grooming, brushing was much more effective than using those coarser leaf blades. It's great to be here at the Merritt Club here in Chicago. You get a chance, one, to walk around with your peers. I found the stops to be very interesting. You can always learn something new. They're well organized, well timed. The variety of companies involved in giving presentation was impressive. I just thought it was a nice atmosphere, a nice atmosphere to learn. I'd encourage them to come.